All right, so we're back with another video for you guys, another reaction video. And today we're going to be reacting to a rail to real man. So rail was on IG Live yesterday announcing the winners to his uh, $700, I guess, giveaway. The raffle within a raffle. And um, he was talking, I guess somebody asked him about the McLaren or something like that. And I think this McLaren is at the same dealer that uh, CJ on 32s got all these uh, Jeep Trackhawks from and the Hellcat Durango. And uh, Rel had some uh, interesting words about the dealership. So let's uh, check this out. And then we're going to react to it afterwards. How are doing, y'all? Really? I like it. I ain't going to lie. For my first time being there, definitely was a uh, good show. Uh, definitely was a good show. You feel me? Memphis in the building, man. Shout out to Memphis, man. Hopefully, I can get down there for uh, Rock Show this weekend. But um, if I can't, uh, hopefully I can, man. I, I gotta wait on this this car to get delivered. So and they probably be coming on the weekend. So I don't know if I'm ready to make it. Hopefully, I can though. Nah, I ain't get the um, I ain't get nothing from Chicago Motor Car. I ain't got time to play with nobody. <laughs> Man, when I see when other people go through stuff, bro, I just, I don't even want to deal with a company. Sometimes I, I, I watch, I absorb how other people get, get handled and treated. Nah, uh, I can't do it. I was just watching Stunner video earlier. Um, and it was, uh, they was talking about some about what you call red key and they was like uh we ain't gonna go get the red key you go get the red key i'm like damn a person that just bought five fucking cars in one day well in two three days well within like three four days apart but eight eight nine cars and all from y'all shit well not really nine ten ten cars from y'all bro shit man you know man you don't do that shit to nobody you don't say no shit like that. Uh, you go get your own key. We can't go get it. Shit, if I'm buying the car from you. You supposed to go get that motherfucker, not me. But uh, yeah, I don't get into other people's business like that. But that shit was just kind of bogus to me. You know what I'm saying? You spending that type of money, and a person don't <laughs> still won't respect you. And the whole time they really just mad, probably because. You know, the gang probably got on their ass about them fucking titles, so. But, shit, it is what it is, man. You live and you learn, man. Move on to the next. But, uh, man, we finna go ahead and do this $700 giveaway. Um, I don't know why this thing sent the names out of order like this, but, um, I had, um, I had emailed them to myself so they can pop up on my laptop. But the number's out of order, but we'll get through it. Zachary, King Zach Ranch, my boy. What it do? What it do? Um, right, if I'm buying a car, I want top tier service, period. Man, for sure, man. Shit, it ain't even that shit. Ain't nobody finna walk up in them four company, period, and buy fucking 10 cars within fucking a two week period span, nigga. Well, I ain't gonna say a two week, week period span, but it's like within two months, though. Shit, within two months. You know, so uh, let's get into it, man. Um, <clears throat> let's get this $700 drawing. Y'all know how we do these. Uh, the way I get the names is when you guys enter for the Hellcat uh, Durango. Whenever I say I'm doing a $700 giveaway, the people, they go enter that just so they can get their name on this list. Get their name on this list, they still able to win at the end of the actual giveaway as well. So this this doesn't take you out. This is just a way of me giving back. And I know a lot of people was like, um, dang, they ain't get the enter. And they want me to hurry up and run it back. If you guys let me know why we in here uh, tonight, if y'all want me to run it back for tomorrow. And uh, tomorrow, why I say that is because 12 o'clock p.m., 12 o'clock a.m. tonight is tomorrow so if y'all want me to run it back i'll run it back right at 12 a.m just so on um, the people that couldn't get on the list can get on the next list so um 
yeah, let's go through the names. See if y'all see y'all name. They they out of order the way I'm gonna be going, but still locate your name and number. The all the names are in order, but the screenshots are out of order. They they email to me out of order. So I'm gonna go to that one. That's the second list. As y'all see. I'm only gonna do this one time, so see if y'all see y'all name. So this is the third list. Let me know. Y'all see y'all name. Okay, I'll definitely run it back for y'all. And only thing you have to do is enter the Hellcat Durango giveaway. And then you go on this list for this giveaway. It's just the only way I can help out the people that support me by getting their names, you know, like this. So. And here go the last page right here. So that's the last hundred names. Don't put nothing in right now. Wait till 12 o'clock. If you want to get on the list, wait till 12 a.m. So that's 12 a.m. in my time, in, in, in central time. So that'll be 1 o'clock on the East Coast. And that'll be 10 o'clock on the West Coast. So 10 o'clock on the West Coast tonight. 1 in the morning for East Coast and 12 at night for Central, Central Chicago time. So, yeah. But hopefully y'all seen y'all numbers and y'all know we got the 100 balls right here. So uh, as y'all gonna see, y'all gonna see me within this looking that way, not looking at the ball rack and I'm gonna pull a number, man. And that's how we do it, so. Y'all ready? All ready, man. Let's get it. Sixty-seven. Sixty-seven. Congratulations, man. Sixty-seven. All right. Let's go. Let's uh look over here, see who is sixty-seven. I'm finna uh give y'all the call right now. Larry Clark. Sixty-seven, Larry Clark. Larry Clark. Congratulations, Larry Clark, man. You definitely won you $700. I'm finna hurry up and uh, get you on the phone before it get too late at night for you. And um, just be by your phone. Congratulations. I will be running it back at 12 a.m. Central Time. 12 a.m. Central Time. And I will be... Um, I will be... Yeah, seven, twelve a.m. Central, one a.m. East Eastern, and ten p.m. ten p.m. Um, Western. Western. So, yeah. So. All right. So that was Rel to Real on IG Live announcing the winners to his a uh, seven hundred dollar giveaway. And then he talked about the uh, the dealership, this dealership right here, uh, Motor Cars of Chicago. Now, some people were asking him about the McLaren, right? I guess he was going to buy a McLaren at this dealer. But it didn't seem like he really answered any questions about the McLaren and whether he's actually going to buy a McLaren. Um, it just seemed like he's upset with the way they treated uh, CJ on 32s because CJ, I guess, got 10 cars. He said 10 cars, right? I mean, he got the first, um, the first three Trackhawks. Then he got a McLaren, the yellow one, the Spider. So that's four. Then he went back for this raffle to get three more Trackhawks, and then a Hellcat Durango. 
So that's four in addition to the other four. And then you also had another Jeep that I guess had like 2,000 horsepower, the other Trackhawk, the one that, yeah, the one with 2,000 horsepower, the one he said he's going to keep. So that would be nine. And then Marty Mars would be 10. So yeah, I guess Rail was right. It's 10, 10 cars. So I guess he's um he didn't like the way they treated CJ. So I guess for those reasons, he's not going to get a McLaren. And uh, which McLaren is it? Because uh, some people are saying it's the blue one. This green one is actually like pretty nice. This green one has like the the P one, the P one front bumper. So is it this one right here, the GT? This one's got six hundred and twelve horsepower. This one's actually this one's actually pretty new and pretty fast. Um, the GT. And these, I guess, are the old ones. The um, the five seventies. These are still pretty pretty good cars, and they've man, the depreciation on those cars is crazy. It's almost like half is gone. But I guess this is the one, right? Because I know he's been looking at seven twenty S's. Like it's been like. Man, it feels like it's been a couple years that he's been looking at the McLaren 720. And I don't know. Now I'm not really like the 720S doesn't really like feel like that special anymore. Like at this point, you got to get up to like a 765 or like maybe a McLaren Senna or something like that. The 720 and this one, I don't know, like... What's so special about this one? Is it because of the paint job? Like, it's blue? Kind of like a blue-purple feel? Like, the only 720S I, I did like, actually, is the one... I don't even like the one that CJ got, the yellow one. I guess unless he customizes it. But as is, I don't... It's not nothing too special. I like the one to... Um, I like the, the green one, the one he has in uh, Texas, which it doesn't seem like he's actually driven that much. That one's got, like, obviously it's modified, it's loud. That's probably the only one I like. Um, but this is, like, what's the what's so special? I don't know if this is the one he's talking about or the other one, the GT, but there's nothing really all that special about it. It's just... Yeah, it's blue. I mean, I haven't really seen... I don't think we see too many McLaren 720Ss in this color, like a blue-purple. I don't I don't even remember ever seeing a blue-purple-looking um, 720S. Like, do you guys still like the McLaren 720? Like, I don't know. I feel like that... It was popping, like, around, like, two years ago. Like, when he first, like... When he was looking at the one that was black, he was looking at a black spider one in Texas, I think. Um, around that time, it was like popping, but now I don't think, I don't think a 720s is like. I mean, it's still a cool car; it's fast and all that. But for YouTube, I don't know. I think for like that price, two fifty or whatever, like you can probably do a lot better than that. Um, let's see what they have. Cause that 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 dealer does definitely has a big showroom, but you can't really see all the cars on video. So they got the 488, which is a a good car. 458 is holding their value pretty pretty well. Um, so I think like a 458 would be really good because it definitely holds its value. It's been holding its value pretty strong, but for YouTube and a lot of YouTubers like to customize cars. Um, I don't know how how much you can really customize a 458 aside from exhaust and paint and wheels. They got a couple Aventadors, Huracans, Porsches. Why do I feel like the website doesn't have all the cars? Because like when CJ's recording inside, I mean, this is the right dealer, right? Motor. Motor Cars of Chicago. I think, yeah, this is the same dealer. It just seems like they got way more cars on video. At least exotic cars, but 
here is just like McLarens. We already seen that green one. That green one is actually pretty nice. I actually like that one. Um, that Maybach is real good. R8s. That's not too bad. 150. And R8s are basically like, they're basically the equivalent of a Lamborghini Huracan. It's just like a, a silent car. So you get the same performance of a Huracan just without the uh, the flash. So some people will recognize it. Other people won't really care because they'll be like, oh, that's an Audi, right? But it's still fast. It's fast. It's like a Huracan. So don't get it wrong. Um, everything else is just pretty like blah. G-Wagons, that shit is boring. Um, the rate, I think that that's like a... It's outdated now. Like, Organic got the rate, like, almost like... It feels like 10 years ago. Like, that car is too old. The GTRs, they still look the same. Porsches look the same. Like, Porsche, Nissan, GTRs... I don't think they really hit that well on YouTube. There's more track hogs. Like, it seems like they carry mostly track hogs. This AMG GT is nice. Um, but I don't know if that's a good content car, like, to do car content on. So, I mean, I guess the, the McLaren is, for rail, I think the McLaren might actually be a better option. Because, I mean... I mean, you could get an R8, but it's just, it's not like, it doesn't have the flash factor. It's just, you just know it's a fast car, and it's basically the cheaper version of the Huracan. But aside from that, I don't think you can do much with it car content-wise. Um, BMWs, fast cars, but boring. I don't know. I feel like the website just doesn't have a lot of inventory. I feel like on video, it just looks like they have so much shit. But on their website, everything looks pretty... Like, there's like probably like 10 cars that are all that. And then the rest are just... These, uh, these Audis right here, the SUVs that just passed, those are like Euruses. It's just like the R8 to the Huracan. The SUVs are just like the... Uh, the her um the euros but uh anyways let me know what you guys think in the comments about what rail had to say i mean he didn't really um he didn't really respond back to the uh, mclaren question he kind of just like made it seem like he really isn't that interested in the dealer based on how they treated cj with the titles um and i guess he said something about stunner reese's video and some hellcat key or something like that i guess Maybe the Jeeps were missing a key or... I don't remember exactly what he said, but... I guess for those reasons, he's not going to get a McLaren at the uh, Chicago dealer. Um, but like like I said, I don't know that McLaren 720S is, is like... Like, is going to really... Is a good car for content. Like, if, especially if it's going to meet your main car for content. You know, because CJ got so many cars... So that yellow one, I think he only did like maybe two videos with it and we haven't seen it again, right? Because he's got so many other cars that he does content with. Um, but yeah, I don't know about it being your main focus in terms in terms of car content at this point. Like maybe you got to go up to the 765. But yeah, man, let me know what you guys think in the comments.